It's Tess that I'm here today with a crafting haul. I don't normally do craft hauls, but my husband and I were out running around today. I really needed a few things, so we decided to go to a couple craft stores. Well, I decided. He went to Lowe's. Um, I have, like, glitter on my forehead. Is it gone? Yeah. Anyway, I'm standing in a different location because I'm filming on my tablet because my I didn't want to set everything up just to film this short video. So, in no particular order, I'm going to start with the Dollar Tree. And the first thing I got was this vinegar jar. I tried to film this video once already, but I ran out of room on my tablet, so I had to erase some stuff and start again. So this isn't actually for vinegar. I'm going to try my hand at making my own coffee syrup, so we'll see how that goes. It might be an epic fail, but I can always put vinegar in there if worse comes to worse. Next, I bought this Angel of Mine Baby Liquid Powder. It's a lotion. I see a lot of people do Dollar Tree hauls where they use the creamy Angel of Mine lotion, but I love the smell of baby powder. And this smells so good. So I picked it up to try. I hope it works. I also got my nerds that I always get from the Dollar Tree that I keep beside my laptop for little snackies. Then, what else? Where did I put my other stuff? I also got some washi tape, which my husband hates that word. He's like, don't call it washi tape. I'm like, but it is washi tape. That's what it's called. So I got three washi tapes at the Dollar Tree. This one is just flowers. This one has little birds on it. So cute. And then the last one, I don't know where I put it. Ay, ay, ay. I have everything sitting here. In a, you can see it in the mirror right here. Laundry basket with stuff sitting on it. Why can't I find the other one? Oh, well. I got this blush, and it's by... Beauty Benefits by Wet n Wild. There's no color written on it anywhere. It just says blush. <laughs> so, I don't know. It's just blush. Just blush. Let me find the other washi tape. And the last washi tape looks like this. It's just blue and purple. So there's that. I also got, a, right around back to school, I got these trays from our Dollar Tree. I got one. And I put it at my desk, and I really like it, you know, for pencils, paper clips, whatever. And my husband was like, can I get one of them? Well, when I went to our Dollar Tree, they said it was seasonal, and they didn't have any more. So the Dollar Tree I went to today had three, and I bought them all. So I got those. And then I also got stickers. These cute little owls. So pretty. And flowers that look like this for my planner. And the last thing from the Dollar Tree was a lemon juicer. I never owned a lemon juicer. This one's just plastic. But I'll try it. I use lemons a lot, so hopefully that works good. At Target, I got a pack of pencils. They're just pretty fun colored pencils. I'll take these to work. There's 24. They were $2.99, I believe. Hope those don't fall. Okay, and at Hobby Lobby, I got more washi tape. Listen, I'm addicted to washi tape. And my mom and dad were over tonight, and my mom's like, what are you doing with all that tape? I'm like, I don't even care if I do anything with it. It's just so pretty. I want to look at it. It's just fun. I mean, I'm using it for my planner, but... And I've never owned a planner before, and I just bought a cheap one from Walmart. Because I'm not a stick-with-it kind of person. I start out all gung-ho with something, and then a month or two in, I'm like, what planner? I don't have a planner. I've never seen a planner before. You know? I'm one of them. I have the attention span of a gnat. <laughs> I really, really do. So, I also, like, am spontaneous. I'm spontaneous, and when it comes to shopping, typically, and I have no attention span. So, I also got these journaling cards. These were from Hobby Lobby also. They were $9.99, and I had a 40% off coupon. So, there's a variety of journaling cards, which I'll use for my planner. Now, let's realize here that I bought a ton of stuff. Not really a ton. I've had a ton of stuff because I used to scrapbook years ago. So I have a lot of supplies for that. So I didn't have to buy too much. So I have a ton of stuff for a planner that I got from Walmart that's smaller than this box. So I don't know where I think I'm going to put all this stuff. Because it's not going to close if I put two more pieces of paper in it. <laughs> so we'll see. Um, we'll see how it goes. It's going to be one of those things that falls by the wayside. I just know it. Anyway. The reason I went to the store is um, I needed a paper trimmer or paper cutter. I bought about 15 years ago a Fiskars paper cutter that says it's a 12 
it cuts 12 inch pieces of paper, which is what most of my scrapbooking papers are, but it never did. It's like a quarter of an inch too short. So today I went and bought a paper cutter from Michaels and I used a 50% off coupon. So I got this for $12.50 and I took this and went over to the paper aisle and held up a 12 inch piece of paper and made sure that this was going to cut that size paper. And it did. It will. And I also got replacement blades. So there's that. And then, listen, at Michael's I had like so many rolls of washi tape in my hand and I put them back. And the reason I put them back is I may have found this roll of huh? washi tape. Look at that. It's so cute. All these the chevron, and chevron's my favorite print. So this was only $5.99 for 13 rolls of washi tape. Yeah, 13 rolls of washi tape for $5.99. Well, that's a bargain. Bargain, bargain. And I ordered a bunch of washi tape from eBay. That may have happened the other day. So it's coming from China. So by the time it gets here, I'll have used all those rolls up. But that's how slow shipping is can be from China. But I don't care. It was cheap, so I'm willing to wait. I don't need it like today or anything. Then they had these packets of paper for a dollar seventy nine at Michaels. So you get I don't know how many pieces of paper. It doesn't say it doesn't say. Twenty four sheets. Double sided. So this one looks like this. And it like chalkboard one. And then I got this one, which is Everyday Basics, and it's not open yet, but these are the prints on it. So it looks like that. And then last but not least that I bought today, I love to read. I love books, and I love anything that's, like, French chic looking. That's hence my room. <laughs> um, but anyway, I wanted to keep all this stuff that I use for my planner in a box. So I was on the search for the best box ever. And I found this. Oh, it looks like a book. It says Paris. It has the Eiffel Tower. And, wait for it. It's a box. And it says this book belongs to, and it has like date stamps in it. Oh my gosh. I'm in love with this. I'm going to put it on my shelf and put my stuff in it for my planner. And even this looks like pages. And this was $11.99 and they were 50% off. So, it's awesome. I can admire that every single day. It's just lovely. That's everything I bought. It was just a short little haul. And thanks for watching. Sorry the video quality is a little uh, but I wasn't going to drag all my stuff out just to film this quick haul. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.